Uh, you'll find the eastbound QEW heading towards the Gardner, also busy in a couple spots from Royal Windsor to Ford Drive, and again here on Ontario to Dixie. Westbound Gardner slowing through Jarvis as well as traffic has a look at that eastbound issue. Then we've got more delays from Spadina to west of Jameson. Westbound QEW construction going on west of Ford Drive. That's where the left lane is blocked. So it is busy approaching Ford Drive to west of it through this construction zone, getting quite heavy, in fact, as you head into that maintenance. A westbound 401 weekend construction still going on from the Allen to west of Keel and the collectors. Only a single lane is getting through in those collector lanes. So we've got a delay from That's west true. of the 404 yeah. Express and from Avenue in the collectors. Yeah. Yes, you heard that correctly. The express lanes are much heavier through this area. So if you're traveling the, the uh, West 401, I would probably take the collectors even with even that construction yeah. that's going on. Uh, we've happened. got, uh, yeah. looks like, a new issue on the eastbound 401 was just notified by uh, MTO. Yes, indeed. Another vehicle fire here. This is eastbound 401 uh, right at Dixie in the collectors. And in fact, the express lanes affected here too. Holy cow, this is quite a scene. We've got eastbound 401 collector lanes, only the right shoulder open. And in the express, only the left shoulder is open. A massive vehicle fire right at the cement divider between the express and collector lanes here. And as a result, let's just scan through here. Uh, the East 401 is pretty well solid from the 410 to just east of Dixie, where this problem is. Uh, this is a massive scene. Thank you very much. We've got a massive issue on the eastbound 401. Uh, this is right at Dixie where express and collector lanes have just been completely blocked because of this vehicle fire uh, that's taking place. It looks like it's on the left side of the collector lanes. And uh, right now they've blocked all lanes because of this fire that is still burning. Uh, we don't have fire crews on scene just yet, I don't believe, unless they've just arrived. And in fact, it looks like they may have, yes, they're just starting to douse this vehicle fire. Eastbound 401 is at a standstill from approaching the 410, both express and collectors to Dixie, where again, all express Another and truck. all collector lanes are completely blocked at Dixie for this vehicle fire. And we have a bit of a westbound 401 delay through here as well. It's actually quite heavy from south of the airport in the express over to Dixie. And the collector lanes westbound are just a bit slow through Dixie as well. It's all because of the visual distraction of this massive vehicle fire on the eastbound side. Express and collector lanes completely blocked in Dixie. It's because of a vehicle fire. Fire crews are on the scene and they're dousing this fire. They have been for the last few minutes, but it's still burning. So as you travel through this area, the East 401 is jammed solid from approaching the 410 to Dixie, both express and collector lanes completely blocked. We'll keep you updated as this develops. At the traffic center, I'm Kyle Hawking. Six City News Time, 10 05. This just into 6:50 News. Go Transit says trains are not running along portions of the Lakeshore West Line following a fatality east of Port Credit. Go buses are running between Union Station and Long Branch, as well as Port Credit and Clarkson stations. The police say the call came in around 8:40 this evening. The coroner is currently on the scene. Here with 6:50 News for the latest on this developing story. Express and collector lanes blocked at Dixie because of a massive vehicle fire still in the process of being extinguished. So avoid the East 401 between the 410 and Dixie. It's totally stopped. From the 680 Traffic Center, I'm Kyle Hawking. This is City News Time 1021. In time for traffic and weather together on the water. Let's look at the roads. Here's Kyle Hawking. This report brought to you by 407 ETR. We have a major issue on the eastbound 401. All express and collector lanes are completely blocked at Dixie because of a Truck. Nobody's moving at all. I'm just working at the 
Oh, that thing is massive. Wow. It just totally stops. Nobody's moving because nobody's getting through. And Dixie, and the westbound 401 scene delays through here as well. It's busy south of the airport. They're following him. They're getting fed up. They're like, you know what? I'm going to follow him. I'm going to follow that guy. And then you're fine. Get Probably. Faster. No lanes are blocked westbound, but everything. Yeah, all everybody else. He must be in a hurry, too. Eastbound 401 at Dixie with his vehicle fire cleanup. Well, you've got a problem on the eastbound Gardner. Uh, no, it's uh, no, right uh, just east of Jarvis, where two left lanes are still blocked with the collision. Crews are on scene. The Gardner itself is busy from the exhibition grounds to east of Jarvis. We've got a westbound Gardner delay as well from Cherry to uh, Jarvis, also yeah, with the visual distraction. Construction going on in the QEW, eastbound QEW by the fourth lane. They're not going to get anywhere. Two lanes are blocked. And they're not. Everybody else is doing it, too. Yeah, but they're the not going to get anywhere. Yeah, I like how everybody's getting impatient. And still this westbound 401 construction. Uh, from Welcome the alley to, to west of Keel, the collector lanes are a single lane for maintenance through here, so it's heavy from about Bayview and the Express and approaching the Allen and the collectors over to this construction. Eventually, they're going to have to open either the collectors something, or the yeah. Something, yeah. Eastbound 401 at Dixie, and we likely will for several hours. Mm. It's at Dixie where all express and collector lanes are currently blocked because of a transport truck that caught fire. And it sounds like, according to the OPP, that it actually crossed over the cement divider between the express and collector lanes. Right now it's sitting on its side in the express, and uh, the fire has been put out, but now the cleanup begins. And this is going to be an extended cleanup for several hours, likely. So as you travel the eastbound 401, the closure is actually being set up at Huron, Ontario. All traffic at Huron, Ontario will be forced into the uh, collector lanes and then forced off of the highway just a little bit further along. So as you travel through here, all express and collector lanes will be closed from Huron, Ontario over to Dixie as crews work to clean this vehicle fire up. It's actually a transport truck that caught fire. to Dixie, all express and collector lanes are closed. So as you travel through this area, you're finding, of course, a heavy delay. Uh, as you approach here on Cherio, that's where the express and collector lanes split apart, just past uh, the Mississauga area. As you approach here on Cherio, all traffic's being forced into the collectors, and then you're either forced onto the 410 or the 403. Once you get there, you cannot continue going east. Now, there is a bit of a light at the end of the tunnel, at least for traffic that has already passed here on Cherio on the 410. In the collector lanes, we're now seeing the right shoulder being allowed through. Uh, so all collector lane traffic, anybody who has gone past the 410, uh, you'll shortly be allowed through this closure, or at least, uh, uh, well, yes, you will be uh, just uh, getting through this closure momentarily. For express lane traffic, uh, so far, no change. This transport truck that caught fire and is on its side is actually in the express. So uh, they may instead, the OPP may instead turn you around if you're in the express lanes rather than allowing you to go through the scene of this crash. Uh, it's a major cleanup that has to take place and it's mainly in the express lanes here. That's why only the collectors are being allowed to pass through at this point. So expect this to last at least to the beginning of the morning commute, if not into the morning commute. You will certainly want to plan ahead in case this closure is still in effect when we get into the morning rush hour, it could possibly be. Uh, we have uh, right now all traffic traveling east on the 401 being forced into the collectors at Huron, Ontario, and then on to either the 410 north or the 403 west when you get to that point. Traffic that has already gone past this closure, past the uh, 410 and 403, or in the, in the express past here, Ontario, 
Uh, express lanes, so far, no change. The plan is for the OPP to begin turning vehicles around. I don't believe that's happened just yet. In the, ex in the collector lanes, traffic is now being allowed past on the shoulder in Dixie. This is only to let the backup through. Anybody who has not yet reached here, Ontario, you're going to be directed off the highway uh, just beyond that point.